My name is Evelyn Davis. I'm the president of Ghana Women Association of Georgia, a 501c3 organization, which serves as the umbrella organization for Ghanaian women in Georgia. The group make up of progressive, dynamic, professional women who want to bring change into our community by empowering ourselves and our community. We've been in existence for the past three years, and uh, over the past three years, we have achieved a lot. We have donated goods to an orphanage in Ghana, and those goods were in turn distributed to nine other organizations, orphanages in Ghana. We have uh, embarked on several activities that um, Volunteering at MedShare, which um, is a medical supply company that tends to bridge the gap between need and um, want. We also um, have um, an annual publication, which we call the GWAC Pages. Now, what is GWAC Pages? GWAC Pages comprises of Ghanaian and African-based businesses in Georgia. We put them in one directory and we distribute it free of charge to the Ghanaians and Africans in Georgia. You can find anything you're looking for, for instance, like a store, beauty shop, a laundry mat, an African store if you want to watch African movies, where you can get it from, child care, and churches. The other thing that we also do is um, we have volunteered at the Atlanta Food Bank. We do it once a year. Our theme is to empower our community, so we like to give back a lot. Now, over the past two years, we have uh, embarked on uh, publishing a cookbook. Now, that's one of our favorite um, things that we do. We want to collect our mothers and our grandmothers recipes over the years, the ones that we brought from Africa and the ones that we want to teach our children so that when they grow up they will not forget the core recipes that we use back home. So collectively we put together a cookbook and we call it The Taste of G GWAG. GWAG meaning Ghana Women Association of Georgia. That book was launched two years ago in December and every year we put in more recipes. This year our goal is to bring it back and uh, add more recipes. Okay, this is GWAC pages, our business directories. This is the pages where you can get all kinds of um, businesses that have been listed in here. We have a, um, a bridal consulting firm and our event planning. We have um, Ghana embassies in the U.S. listed in here. We have a key embassies in Ghana also listed in here. And then we have our GWAG mission also in the GWAG page. So once you get one, you can read what GWAG is all about and then uh, you can come and join us. Um, we also, over the years, we have uh, plans for, um, this year our plan was to uh, educate the kids. So our focus is on education and um, we're going to give back to uh, the children here and also the children back home in Ghana. Um, one of our Ghanaian sayings say that uh, you educate a man, you educate one person, you educate a woman, you educate a whole community. So GWAC have taken on that slogan that we're going to educate our children. Now um, last year we had um, lots of events, as I have said before. One of the events was partnering with Verizon to uh, do a walkathon to raise funds. We did that last fall and it was very successful. And this is going to be an yearly um, event. So the next one will be coming this year in October. We also, um, last week, which happens to be the 6th of March, last weekend it was Ghana's 54th Independence Day. What GWAC and uh, the Ghana Council 
of Georgia did was Medshare have given a lot to the underprivileged in African countries as far as med uh, medical supplies. And they are based here in Atlanta. So for Ghana's 54th independence, we decided to give back to our community. So we went to Medshare Saturday in the rain. Those of you who live in Georgia, you know last Saturday rained a lot. But uh, we battled the rain and we went to Medshare and we volunteered three hours of our time to help them sort out medical supplies to be taken to Africa and the rest of the underprivileged countries. Our main um, objective is to empower our community. With that saying, we established a business um, part of GYAC where we can help any individual special woman who wants to start up a business, who wants to take um, entry-level computer classes. We have a lot of um, entry-level educational tools to give to any woman who uh, would like to um, call us. Well, GWAG is 501c3 organization. That means that we get tax exemption and we can get sponsorship for corporations. So this year, one of our goals is to get sponsorship for the organization so that we can in turn give it to uh, people in need. Now, every year in December, GWAC hosts the Taste of GWAC or the Taste of Ghana, where we pick up dishes from the cookbook that we have uh, collected together. And uh, we cook it and we have um, an event where we invite our friends, our neighbors, our sponsors to come and taste the foods from Ghana and, and have uh, socialize with the rest of us. So this year, December, we're going to have the same thing. So everybody's welcome to come. Thank you.